I've heard a lot of stories of people how they get into the business and what inspired them to get into the business and how mm. they first saw it was an opportunity. But yours has got to be one of the most extraordinary stories. <laughs> Would you tell us this story? Uh, all right. So, all right, cool. So, I was, um, <laughs> so when I was like 13, um, there was this, you know, like police used to stop and search people is this, a lot. Is this back in Peckham? Back in the, yeah, I was in Peckham at the time and people used to stop and search people and stuff. And I remember me and two of my boys, we were just chilling and we was like, oh, uh, like, if they're going to stop us, we're going to make it hard because we're tired of this. So we said, we're going to run. You have to catch us. And um, <laughs> so we got stopped one time and they were like, oh, stay there. Boys. I was like, nope. And <laughs> we was gone. <laughs> so we started legging it. And I remember I got to this pub um, in Peckham, like, near, there's a place called Bellingham Road in Peckham. And there was this man standing outside. Uh, I think he was on the phone and he was like, hey, I'll come in here. And I, and I went in the pub. Um, and he hid me in the pub. And so he saw you running, thought, I'm going to help this kid He saw me running, yeah, yeah, yeah. He saw yeah. me running, he's like, yeah, get in here. And it was Bob Hoskins. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. And he's like, sit down, sit, sit down in there and just, just chill off for a bit. And I remember one of my boys ringing me and he was like, where are you, where are you, man? I was like, yeah, I got away. Some small white man hid me in a pub. <laughs> I was like... I was like I was like, oh, I was like, there's bare cameras in there, though. I might jump in this film, bro. And, like, <laughs> and, then, and then he was like, all right, go on, off you go. And then I legged it, and um, I told this day, like, I only recently, I think it was about four or five years ago when I started, like, acting, that I realised it was Bob Hoskins. Yeah. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. The man, yeah. So he was filming, I think it was Last Orders. Last he was Orders, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah was film, film, film and outside. so what did you think when you were a kid, you went to this pub and suddenly you see lights, you see cameras? Yeah, I just saw light. I thought he was setting me up, actually, because <laughs> there was just more white men in there. And I was just like, <laughs> this is weird. But he was like sitting there, sitting there, and yeah. I just saw the cameras like, I might just sharpen up. And, and so did you really book. think, okay, maybe, maybe I could have a career? No, nah, yeah, I mean, film. you know, like, it was so close to, you know, where I grew up, like, East Dulwich, so it was like, it can be that close, then why not? You yeah. Know? But you still volunteer in your local area, don't you? Yeah, so I grew up so I grew up in, in East Dulwich and um, there's an adventure playground called Dock and Hill Adventure Playground. And it's like where I kind of honed in a bunch of skills and let out steam and stuff. It's just a safe place for kids in that community to be. And I feel like now, like with all the madness that's going on, I think it's 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 about time that they pump more money into like um, adventure playgrounds and youth services because ever since they stopped I saw like the decline of of you know kids falling out of school. So and a stuff lot of the like trouble that. we see on the streets now yeah. you think may well be uh, at least linked in some way. Yeah 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 I mean there's a lot and... there's a lot more to it but I feel like we've got to start somewhere and I feel like that is a yeah. a safe place for kids to come and kind of nurture these kids and let them go on the right path instead of the wrong. But it must be it must be kind of weird and exciting for them when they see someone who they now know they're presumably they've seen you on Family Land or they've seen you in the other Yeah yeah and some think... of the kids are alright some of them are dickheads. One kid came out to <laughs> <laughs> one time I went, I did, um, I, did this, I did this thing called Youngers and one of the kids came up to me and was like, Oi, you did that Youngers thing, innit? You look fat on telly. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, uh, I almost tripped uh, him up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>